I'm always doing the most Finish my cup and reload Let it swing right back Let it swing right back Hey you guys, welcome back to another video. So in today's video, we are going to be doing this super long, sort of like galaxy artistic set, you know, we've got that clear tip and then we've got the black block um, acrylic in the tips of the shapes, which I thought looked super cute. So I'm going to be using UV Rave, Galaxy and some black acrylic, as well as this number 12 aqua brush from Glitter Planet. We are going to be having some new ones coming in stock, so I'm so excited to show you guys those. I've been working super hard on them. In fact, since we launched the first one, I started straight away working on a new design just because I absolutely love the style of these brushes. So I've already gone ahead and applied the tips and I am wearing the tapered square nail tips. I'll have all the products that I use in this video linked for you guys down below. So if you're interested in purchasing any, then you can obviously go ahead and do that. And if I have any discount codes as well, I will also leave those there for you as well. So I'm going to start off and I'm on this nail applying some black as a base. And as you can see, the heat is seriously making things difficult that black did not even go anywhere like usually you're able to sort of spread it down the nail but acrylic with heat sets so fast so because the temperatures in the UK have risen a lot it's been a lot faster setting has the acrylic so it makes it a little bit more difficult to work with but it's easy if you just sort of work in small sections so I went and applied the black at the cuticle area and then I'm just coming in with the Galaxy Glitter from Glitter Planet and placing that over the top and fading and blending that down so that it's a nice glitter fade. And I really wanted to have a clear tip but then have something sort of like displayed at the end of that clear tip. So I went in over the top of Galaxy with the UV Rave Glitter, I think it is UV Rave or just UV, I'll have it linked below as I said already. But yeah, it really just added a real bright blue um, feel about it. And in the light, you could really see that UV effect take place. It was so stunning. So I just added a few more bits of glitter so that I was happy with how far that fade came down. And basically after that, I'm going to come in with the black acrylic, you know, and we're going to apply this to the tip because this one, I was initially going to do them all just like this with a colour blocking like little line slash rectangle at the bottom of the tip. I thought that would look cute as a nice different aesthetic for a nail. However, I thought in the process, I was like, you know what? It would look pretty cool if there were like loads of different shapes at the bottom. So that's exactly what I decided to do. I do a triangle and also a circle as well. And as I mentioned before, the acrylic was setting so fast that it was hard to kind of like move it around. So I did everything in little steps and little stages. But for the most part, this design is the same. We all have the galaxy at the top fading down and it just goes to clear and it also has that UV glitter over the top. So I'm going to let you guys enjoy the rest of this video and I'll be back later on when I need to have some input. If you are enjoying this video so far then don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Also comment down below if you have been enjoying all the content that I'm providing for you guys. I have so much more to give and so much more videos and so many more ideas that I have that I want to get through. So yeah, I'm really trying hard to keep a schedule. I'm literally working every night until late because that's the only chance I get once I've like packed all the orders, we've got everything done in the office, you know, all that stuff. So yeah, I am really hammering everything. Like everything's getting done for once. No excuses, guys. No freaking excuses. So yeah, I'm going to let you guys watch this vid and I'll be back later on.
Okay, so I'm not gonna lie, once I'd done the circle nail and I saw how perfect it came out, like the actual circle on the end, I was seriously like, I wish I'd have done my circle at the end of every nail because damn, that was easy and it looked freaking bomb. But I'd already committed to doing the other shapes, so that's what we're going to continue doing. And I'm using the number five 3D brush. It's currently out of stock, but we do have more on order, so hopefully they will be with us soon. Just keep checking or sign up for updates if you guys are interested in this product. I'll still link it down below because depending on when you watch this video, it may be back in stock. So I decided to go ahead and add some nebula flakes as well over the top of some of the nails, only over a couple. Now this gave like a purple hue and it was difficult to catch on camera but in person definitely looked absolutely gorgeous. I am thinking of doing a full set with the nebula flakes, I don't think I've done that as of yet but I really want to show you guys just how gorgeous they are because they are stunning. Next it's time to encapsulate the entire set. So when you are encapsulating around any like 3D pieces or 3D sculpted bits, whatever you've got encapsulated in that nail, you wanna make sure that your acrylic is slightly on the wetter side so that it's able to run and seep into those gaps. Otherwise you will end up with air pockets and air bubbles and it just doesn't look for a very nice finish. So yeah, just keep that in mind when encapsulating things that are a little bit not on the normal side, if you know what I'm saying. So I'll go ahead and do that. I'll file and buff off camera and then I'm going to come in and add no wipe top coat and this is where the pure magic happens and the hollow goodness is revealed. It seriously is so stunning and this galaxy glitter honestly is life like seriously.
Okay guys, so this is the final result. I really hope that you've enjoyed this video. I loved creating this set and there is actually a part two to this set. So if you want to see that, it will probably be in tomorrow's video. So yeah, keep a lookout for that. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Comment down below whether you would rock this set, even if you would have it in a shorter length or whether you like these colors or style, if you know what I'm saying. And always remember guys that you are bomb.com lit as fuck and don't ever let anyone tell you any different because you've got this and I love you. Mwah. Goodbye. I'm always doing the most. Finish my cup and reload. Let it swing right back. Let it swing right back.